gentlemen. Y'all slide this shit till school start back. Look, I'm about to slide on you. Yeah. I ain't looking at you, got my eyes on the cab. Baby daddy with me, he don't see class. Look, I could have seen dead flies on you. Yeah. I feel codeine in my tank. But I'm a punk 89 for the gas. Summertime niggas on the ground with the slap. Overtime nigga finna ride till he crash. Baby, I ain't trying to make you laugh, but call me butthead, got my mind on you. Yeah. This ain't a disguise, this a mask. This ain't a Nissan, this a tag. No surprise, boy, you know I'm gonna spaz. All that money getting, boy, you know they gon' ask. I ain't finna play, put the board on your ass. And the artist ain't too forward on the dash. Your girlfriend know we got that. Got it in the hotel, short again, smash. It's just me and my niggas having a blast, living fast, buying the things we never had. We just love something, we ain't never like the rat. All us second, we ain't never had a dad. I did a lot of dirt in my past. guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl Shanique Lewis Neekster whatever you want to call me it's your girl thank you so much for tuning in you guys like I'm so thankful that I'm able to do this right now I'm thankful for you guys okay thank you even though I don't have much subscribers but I'm getting somewhere and I'm thankful for that so thank you for the new subscribers for coming in and for the ones who've been here with me since from the beginning, thank you for still being here because I know I be wishy-washy. I don't, time to time I be, you know, posting and then weeks, months later I post again. But thank you. So, since that's all done, as you guys can tell by the title below, today we're going to be doing my What's in My Baby Girls video <laughs> what's in my baby girl video what's in my baby girl's hospital bag so if you would like to continue to watch stay tuned okay my honey boos stay tuned i gotta get my bag behind me you guys might think it's that close you see i could grab it no i can't <laughs> but so stay tuned all right so we're back okay this is what's, you know, I'm, I'm, I don't know. I feel a little bougie right now. That's why I'm like, well, you know, <laughs> I feel a little bit bougie right now. Um, let's start off with everything that's from the top. Then we're going to go to the bottom. Oh, first, let me show you my bag. If you guys haven't seen it before, I'm going to show you guys the bag. This is the bag that I received at my baby shower from one of my baby's godmother. How pretty this is what I'm going to be using on the first week yeah I'm gonna be using this bag for the first week that she's on earth um this is what I'm taking to the hospital like I said before and also this is what um you know what I'm gonna be using because everything that you guys see in here you might think that oh damn this girl overpacked but that's not the case it's just because I'm using it for the whole week um and plus, I didn't mean, there's certain things I didn't mean add in here yet. But, <clears throat> so let's start off. This is not part of the bag. I just have it on here so I can remember to take it with me. Um, this is a canopy. This is what you're going to put on your car seat, your baby's car seat. And, you know, um, I don't want my baby to be exposed. So I'm going to be hiding her for a little bit. So this is how it looks like. I don't know if you guys can see it well, but yeah. Um, once I um, install it into my car seat, I'll take a picture, post it up on my Instagram page. So if you don't have me as a, you know, as a, if you're not following me on Instagram, my um, info is down below. You'll see it. You can follow me there, and I'll put a picture up when I do get my car seat ready. Um, next I have her blanket that she'll be, um, using uh, in her car seat for pictures, whatever it is. It's one of the fluffy blankets. Pretty, very, very pretty. I got this at my baby shower also. How adorable. It's pink in the outside. It's like a baby pink. I don't know if you guys can see it as well. And then the inside is like an off-white color. Very soft very 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 soft um yep that's one of the items boom um my 
mind you guys, I was recording this video already. Then my sound wasn't working. So I'm kind of annoyed by that. But it is what it is. Like, you know, my favorite couple words. So we're going to start off with her picture. Her picture outfit. This is what I'm going to be using. Um, this is what she's going to be wearing for her pictures. Her brother got her this. And it was so adorable when he, like, like, Rashad is so in love with his sister. Like, he's in love with his sister. He's happy that he's he's going to have a baby sister, that somebody he could protect and, and just play with and enjoy. And I love that about him. He's very sweet. And um, this is the first item. It's a tutu. How cute. This is going to be, like, one of her outfits for her pictures. It's adorable. How cute. This is the back. How cute. It comes with um, a crown. It comes with a little crown. And um, it has some angel wings with it. You know, she's an angel. She's coming on to, to this earth as an angel. So, yeah, how cute. <laughs> And the other outfit, I think in my last video, I did say um, she was going to wear this to come home. But I changed my mind because this is a little bit too big for a newborn to be wearing for, um, how you call it, to come home. And so I just decided to have um, her wear this as a picture outfit. How cute. And no, you guys, I did not wash anything yet. Um, I just put all these things inside of here so I can know exactly what I'm going to be using and what am I going to take with me. So that's the reason why, you know, everything is still, well, some things in here have tags on them because I didn't wash these yet. So don't, don't, don't be in the comments talking about, oh, you got to wash that. Oh, this, this, and that. <laughs> um, um. I was going to show you guys the going home outfit, but I don't know yet. I think I should because, you know, I'm not going to be posting any pictures of her online anywhere. So I will show you guys what she, you know, what she's going to be wearing. So this was the first couple items. I got this and this little cute sweater, sweater jacket thing. It has like little ears with it. Cute. These were the first, when I found out that she was a girl, I was so happy. I went out and bought, these were in clearance. And you know your girl is going to snatch anything in clearance. So how cute and adorable. And I'm like, you know what? This is what she's going to be wearing to go home. Underneath, she will be wearing this cute gray onesie. I do want her to wear all gray and white due to the fact that she has so much pink stuff. So... I wanted her to be a neutral and warm by the time she comes home. And um, I have a bunch of onesies in here that she'll be wearing. You know, once again, this bag is going to be filled with things for the whole entire week, including with the things I'm taking to the hospital. So, boom. You know, she has a bunch of onesies in here. Cute. And all of them are newborn. Because my aunt recently had her baby and she was like, girl, I understand like, you know, babies be different sizes, whatever they might say. But these, um, the zero to three months do not be fitting all of them. So just bring some newborns. So all these onesies are newborns. I do have um, the zero to three in here too. But the zero to three are, how you call it, sleepers. The sleepers I have for her. See how cute. If you guys notice, you see a lot of pink too, right? How adorable. This one has like hearts on them. Um, What else? Oh, this little cute pants to go, you know, any onesie that she got on. Um, she has some receiving blankets in here. Oh, I got more onesies. More onesies, you guys. They're so tiny. I can't believe like that's how big she's going to be. When she comes on this earth and she's going to be touching down. Oh, I have another sleeper. See, all these things were like folded and rolled up. 
but I gotta wash them anyways. This one says sweet on it. How cute. Mm. What else do I have in here? Um. Oh, receiving blankets. How cute. This one was for her brother. I had this when um, Rashad was born and I was like, you know what? I would love to use this with her too. And yes, this blue. It's okay to have some color. And I have another blue one that I bought. You know, get some other colors in there. Um, I have this pink heart one with white hearts on them. How cute. What else? Um, oh, I have her grooming kit. This one is a mini one, the cute little mini mouse. How adorable. I have her little brush in it. You know, just a few items. And a nail clipper. Where is the nail clipper? You know, since the hospital don't provide nail clippers and just in case she's born with super long nails, I don't want her scratching her face. Oh, speaking of that, <laughs> you guys, don't mind me. My brain kind of slow right now. I have mittens so she don't scratch herself. There we go. Got some mittens in here. Another color. Some socks, you know. Um, some of these, um, some of the stuff that's in here, Rashad added into. He chose them, and I was like, you know what? You go ahead and choose an outfit or a couple for your sister to wear when she comes on Earth. Like I said, he's very excited. And these little booties, <laughs> little booties, booties that I got also uh, with the gray. Um, outfit you know so happy and uh this is what rashad also got her some jordans talking about mommy you know i think i said the story already but he was like mommy you need to get something like i know you have a lot of cute stuff but you need to get something cool <laughs> so that was his idea of getting cool jordan i guess jordan is cool that sucks um this little pink beanie head thing oh this is what she's gonna be wearing to come back home how adorable and um uh, got some i had some bows in here too not bows but like this little flower bandana how do you call this but you know what it is i got like this cute little flower thing how adorable you know, I'm having a girl, so I'm so excited to dress her up, make her cute, and stuff like that. And I know I'm not going to be needing these, but hey, like I said, the first week, this is what's going to be her bag. I got her this. My cousin um, got it for me. And, you know, a cloth. So when she spits up, throw up, whatever she does, these are here for her. And then, in the outside, you know what's going on? Why I keep looking out there again? It's because my neighborhood has like a bunch of Christmas lights. I know this is out of the subject, but my neighborhood has a lot of Christmas lights. I don't know if they're going like, it's like a race or some kind of competition where who has more of the lights. It's like one of the movies. You would think you're living in a movie in my neighborhood. So cars are driving every single day looking at lights and stuff. So that's the reason why it's like a bunch of cars out there. So I'm just, you know, don't mind me. So, sorry. <laughs> so back to the video, back to the subject, what's in my baby girl's bag. Um, the outside pockets, there's like four in total. And I only filled it up, I only have one thing out in the outside pocket. This right here is a, a pacifier um, holder pocket thing. In here, I have her pacifier in here. It's cute, one of the Dr. Brown ones. Um, and it comes in um, with the little pack, the little holder, you know, so it doesn't get no germs into it. 
So I have that in there. And also I need to add in a, a hand sanitizer. So once I do that, my bag will be completed. Um, oh, I have a bunch of diapers in here too. <laughs> I got diapers in here too. There's somewhere in here. Yeah, these are the diapers I have in here. How cute. Oh, how adorable. But yes, you guys, that's what's in my baby girl's bag so far. And um, I'm excited. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm very excited, you know, I'm super, super excited because she'll be coming in soon. I don't know when, but she'll be here soon. You know, she's going to be a winter baby. Um, I have literally four weeks left. I No, four weeks and a couple days left because I'll be 36 on Sunday. So, yeah. So, after the 37, that'll be 30, um, December 31st. Anytime after that, she'll be ready to come. <laughs> Anytime. So, I'm ready to meet her. I can't wait to meet her. And um, I don't know if this is going to be my last video. I don't know. But if it is, I just want to say Merry, Merry Christmas. And I hope you guys have a happy, happy new year. Okay, you guys? I love y'all so much. And um, if you really like this video, comment, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel. Um, you guys are going to see me more often. Trust me. I, you guys are going to see me more often. The fact that I was, you know, pregnant and this one was like a very, this pregnancy took a toll of me. So I didn't get the chance to really record what I really wanted to record. But once she's out, I will not be vlogging her. No, I won't be vlogging her or having her in anything yet until she gets a little bit older. And once that's done, um... You guys, like I said, I just can't wait to let you guys know what's in store in 2018. I'm just excited. And um, you know what? I think I'll be back before the before the year ends. So I can so I can let you guys know my New Year's resolution and and um what else? I don't know. Like I said, if you guys don't see me, I just wanna say happy new year, you guys. Happy New Year. I hope you guys you know, do what you guys got to do for the new year. Kick 2018's butt. <laughs> so, I love you guys once again. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I'll see you guys next year. Maybe. Maybe not. Who knows. But you guys are going to see me more. Like I said. <laughs> Alright? So, love you.